this is his first for you. Oh my Miss McKnight, you're one of this year's winners of the Coastal Electric Bright Ideas Prize Contest. Thank you so and much. And we want to thank you for your innovative idea. I heard a little bit about it. It's like virtual traveling almost? Or? Yes, using virtual reality goggles. So I'm hoping that we can bring that into our school and help our students who don't get to travel outside of Richmond Hill to get to take virtual field trips. As a former language arts teacher, I just thought it was always so neat. You know, we would read these novels and we'd go to all these cool places with the novels, but our kids didn't really actually know what those places looked like. So the virtual reality goggles will help us to actually take them virtually to Alaska and see where the setting for Hatchet is and all of these other um, amazing novels that our teachers here share with our students. Okay, so what do you think will be the most unique place that they'll go to virtually? Well, I think it would be, you know, we have so many kids here who um, have parents who are in the military, mm -hmm. so they can travel to the Middle East and see what that actually looks mm -hmm. like and travel to different places in the United States, travel abroad virtually. So just kind of opening up um, their minds to what our world actually looks like.